Now, talking of idealism, there is a fellow called Justin Welby. He's the Archbishop of Canterbury. And he spoke to the House of Lords about the cross-channel migration crisis last week. This is what he had to say. When migrants arrive here, our system is grossly wasteful in both human and financial terms. Control has become cruelty. Staggering inefficiencies by successive governments trap people in limbo at incredible expense to the taxpayer in the system for years, unable to build a life or to contribute to our society. Well, that was Archbishop Welby. You see, we're being cruel. Well, I agree, Archbishop. We shouldn't be keeping people in Manston. Maybe, maybe the Ritz. Maybe the Ritz, the Savoy is not bad. It's been referred recently and he wants them to work. That's what Welby is saying. And if you allow people who've come to the country through illegal means to work, you've no idea who you're letting in and you're sending a signal, an open door to countless others. It doesn't make sense. But many other things have happened in the week I've been away. We're now told that holiday camps will be opened up. Uh, the Ukrainian refugees and the homeless will be booted out uh, because they're going to be cheaper per capita than hotels. We've learned in Manchester, published the day by The Telegraph, that you have people living in these hotels commuting, commuting to work uh, and getting 20, 30 quid a day in cash backhanders, working as lookouts and other jobs for criminal gangs. Don't say I didn't warn you about all of this. Oh, the numbers over the weekend. Yeah, don't worry about the cold weather. Uh, 315 crossed the English Channel on Saturday, 240 crossed the English Channel yesterday. We're told there are roughly 6,000 waiting in the Dunkirk area to cross at some point between now and Christmas if we get calm weather. And the tough criminal charges the government said will be brought in for those illegally trying to gain access to Britain. Well, so far, so far, the attempted prosecutions are running at 0.3 of 1%. And Rishi keeps saying, he keeps talking tough, he's going to deliver solutions. I'm not sure, but the icing on the cake is we now learn there's a border force strike. What on earth is all that going to mean?